the volume of the sample over the total volume. The diluent is how much we add to the volume of the sample, as you can see here, the volume of the sample plus the diluent to make the total volume. So it can also be expressed as a 1 to 10 ratio. The dilution factor is simply the inverse of the dil dilution. In dilu so serial dilutions, we're going to start with 20 ml and use these blanks as expressed in the book. We have a 99 diluent plus 1 ml, which makes us have a 1 to 10 dilution and a 10 to the second dilu diluent, or 1 to 10 to the second dilution factor. We are going to use this plate here because it has 72 viable colonies that are within our range to find the concentration of the bacteria. So we're going to multiply. According to the book, we should use this equation, but I decided to add one more step to simplify it. We're going to take 72 colonies divided by the amount that we extracted, 0.1 ml, then times it by the dilution factor to get this. And then um, another example, or, and then we're going to find the number of bacteria using the concentration that we found before. So we have the concentration of the bacteria right here times by the original sample to get this as the number of bacteria.